Hey guys, welcome back to another YouTube video, and today I'll be showing you how to bypass securely on a school Chromebook. So, so like say, so I'll show you that I do have securely say, like I want to play Sans Real on this because you can't like run Fortnite or whatever. See, so securely blocks it. So to bypass this, you're just gonna wanna, like, say I wanna play Zombs Royale. I could go like this, and I could just click on this. Here, wait. Oh my god. So, say I just search Zombs Royale, right? Say I wanna play it, cause you can't get Fortnite, cause you can't run .exe apps or something like that so say I want to run it I can't so I clicked on the link securely blocks it so what you're gonna do is you're going to go search up Tom's Royale again or whatever you're doing you're gonna go like this you're gonna click you're gonna click this you're gonna click you're gonna click that so control U gonna bring up a page source just wait you're gonna click um you're gonna click control a on the page source control a and then you're gonna click control c which will copy it click it a couple times if you just to make sure then what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to um this website I will leave the website link in the description so and then you're just gonna click control V on the website as soon as you open it you can just control V and you will paste the page source now you can close out of these and you can go like this and just minimize that so now it's like you're on Google but you're not you're on the page source so now you can just go here and click on Zombs Royale, and there you go. That is how you bypass securely on a school or non-school Chromebook. So, I'll just show you it works. Just wait. Just sounds right. It takes a while to load on Chromebooks, or at least my Chromebook. My Chromebook's not that fast for our school, but yeah, just loading up. Just make. It's just just a little bit slow. I'll, I'll be back when it's loaded. Okay, so it just finished loading. So this is the uh, website or whatever. You can just you can interact. As you can see, you can play on it. You can play on it. You can click solo, and it will load you into a game. Let me turn down my sound. I'll just load you into the game here. See, works perfectly fine. It, it's a little bit laggy because I'm recording. Like I said, my Chromebook's not that good. So, I wonder what those are. Maybe it updated. It looked like it was showing a keyboard. So, I'm just going to play a game here for you guys. I guess I don't know where to drop. It's so laggy. Why are you? Why are you? The lull. That, that's just amazing. Well, so, yeah, that, that is how you bypass securely. That is how you bypass securely on a school Chromebook or 
just just in general how to bypass securely so yeah this you can do this with discord see a bunch of videos now say i want to join discord here i'll show you guys sans royale so say i want to join sans royale it doesn't work because securely blocks it but if i type in sans royale and then i uh, open a task manager you used to be able to click on securely click end task and quickly go over to it and click enter and it would load up but obviously a bunch of people use that at my school it got blocked it's pretty annoying so today i'm showing you guys how to do that and use uh secure uh hmm, get past securely without having to do that so yeah oh maybe that will help because now it's less laggy oh yeah that's actually a lot better oh my god i might be able to play this now but also i will be uploading a fortnite video soon because i'm getting a new computer to play fortnite so yeah and I'm getting some RAM for my birthday for that computer. So I'll be playing Fortnite soon, uploading some Fortnite videos, which I love. And I will be playing it on uh, PC and not uh, console like I usually do. But yeah, so come on. I killed him and then that guy killed me. Oh, I thought I died, but. Yeah, so that's how you bypass securely. Thank you guys for watching. Just, just nah. Thank you guys for watching, and goodbye.